One of the most preventable problems we see with parts that come into our inspection department is thread depth. This is when a thread is not fully engaged to the depth in a drawing. First things first, always make sure that you have a third party inspecting your work. Just like proofreading a document, you don't always catch your spelling errors, but it's very easy for someone else to point those out. Check the part immediately for burrs and chips at the bottom of the hole. Holes should be clear and free of oil and threads should look sharp. In this case, we are looking at a blind quarter 20 thread and a drill depth of 0.65 inches. We will do this with a calibrated thread gauge. Make sure the calibration is not expired. The go side should easily go all the way in and should not bind. If it does not go in easily, you will likely need to re-tap the thread. Next, insert the no-go side and turn it as many revolutions as it will turn. It should not turn more than two revolutions. If it does, the threads need to be redone. This is one of the first things that our inspectors check for. Thread depth can be checked with calipers and a mating piece, a go-no-go -go gauge, or if the hole is deeper than the gauge allows, you can use an off-the-shelf screw. Note that the screw is never substituted for a calibrated gauge. The technique I'm using with this off-the-shelf screw is to first fully engage it into the part. Then measure the distance between the head of the screw and the body of the part. I'm then going to zero out my caliper, holding it still at that distance, and then measure the entire screw. The difference I see here is going to be the thread depth. We want you to follow the specifications of the job, so always strive for perfection. That said, tapping deeper than required is better than being too shallow, so please be cautious of that. If you find any defects in the process, check to see what tools you are using. Plug taps should be clean and sharp. Single point tools should be the same. That's it! If you follow these rules, you should have perfect threads every time.